Lisa. Homecoming is a big event at Aloha. The dance team is now on the bayou. We will have a DJ, casino games, snacks, and photo booths. Everyone is invited to join the Hoko work parties on October 5th and October 9th. On October 5th, there are two four-hour shifts, 10 to 2 or 2 to 6. On October 9th, there is one shift from 3.30 to 7.30. If you work four hours, you can earn a half-price ticket. If you work eight hours, you earn a free ticket. Full-price tickets are $25 with ASB and $30 without. What will we be doing? We will be building a sternwheeler boat, creating rivers, trees, flowers, and fireflies, basically turning the school into a bayou. Stop by K1 if you have any questions. Another part of homecoming is the court. Homecoming court are students voted by you to, rep to represent your class. Make sure to click on the link in the slides to vote for your class's homecoming court. Feel free to vote for me. I'll vote for me. Did you get one of those big envelopes in the mail? Yes, and here's Miss Moore to tell us more what they are about. It's me, Miss Moore, back with another real important lesson. In five, three. What you got in your hand there? Oh, I have an envelope. What are those to you? What are they for? I, well, I know, it's been a while, so uh, envelopes um, have mail in them. And we are here today to talk about online verification forms. And so every school year, everyone has a chance to update all of their information um, in Student View. And um, we have about 600 people who haven't done that yet. So we mailed you guys a paper form. Is that that big fatty envelope I got? Yeah, there's like seven pieces of paper in there. And it's very important information for the school. Things like, like, like what? Okay, things like if you tripped and fell down and we needed to call your parents, we would want to give them a chance to update their telephone number. Um, another thing would be if you have allergies or take different medicines, we need to know that and update it so that we can give you the best health care we can in our building. Um, let's see, what else might be in there? If you moved your address so you can receive things like this mail that might be somewhere else in the world right now. Um, and then there's also a income verification form and the income survey really allows your family and you to uh, get free and, and or reduced uh, benefits here at our school. <laughs> So Miss Moore, everybody gets free or free lunch, free breakfast. Why do I have to fill that form out? That's a really good question, Miss Sinner. So yes, everyone gets free lunch and free breakfast, but we also have um, our activities form. And so part of that form, what, what you can do or get, your family can get a um, waived Chromebook insurance, um, athletics, you can get reduced or waived um, classes, like all the class fees, AP tests, PACT, um, all kinds of things that um, we have to pay for. And if your family qualifies, then we can help make that a little more accessible. Okay, so let me just, let me think this over. So if I play a sport and I qualify, my $100 fee is waived. Possibly. So it's um, either it's completely waived or it could be partially waived. So okay. it's definitely worth checking out. Okay, and then PSAT, AP testing, same deal. Mm -hmm. Could be wholly waived or partially waived. Exactly. All right, excellent. Just filling out a form. Fill out the form. See if your family will, wouldn't mind filling it out. You can bring it back um, in the envelope. And uh, Hey, where do I get a form? Well, first of all, it just came in the mail. So, but if it wasn't in the mail or if you think um, your family might qualify, you can go up to the counseling office to Miss McHugh and get one. Did you check out Club Rush? Yes, did you know we have over 20 clubs? Yeah, one of the biggest clubs on campus is Latino Leadership. Here they are to tell us how to get involved. Hey Warriors, hey, Warriors. just a reminder that there's a meeting this Thursday at 3.35 to 4 in the cafeteria. If you guys want more information or update information, please come check out the bulletin board outside of E3. Bye, see you there. <laughs> oh Here's Mr. Glaciers, believe it or not. I wish it was a 7-Eleven, but I'm not. So, if you think that you are gonna be hungry later, you should come to breakfast, and you could grab a banana, you could grab Cheerios, you could grab an apple, you could grab this banana bread, which I hear is good, lemon bread or bagel, put it in your bag and eat it later. How much is it? Free. It's free. People free. So better than a 7-Eleven. 
much better. So yeah, even though you might not be hungry right when you get here, grab something and eat it later. That's all for today, Warriors.